hi everyone welcome once again to our daily devotions my name is debbie yesterday i spoke on the topic avoid distractions and today i'll continue from same topic distractions are things that we face on a daily basis especially when we're trying to build our relationship with god there's so many things that makes our minds wander a lot today i'll be talking about mary and martha they are friends to Jesus and they invited Jesus for dinner in their home. However, one of them got easily distracted. They both had good intentions, but one was distracted. Join me even as I read from the book of Luke chapter 10 from verse 41 to 42. Before I do that, I would like to say a quick prayer. Lord, I just want to thank you for today. I thank you for granting us yet another opportunity to see this day i pray that you guide us you lead us and you protect us on this day help us and just calm our mind grant us peace and everything that will stop us from worshiping you take it away from us amen so um luke 10 41 to 42 says the lord answered her martha martha you are worried and troubled over so many things. But just one is needed. Mary has chosen the right thing and it will not be taken away from her. You may argue that why would Jesus say that? But Jesus did not condemn what both of them were doing. He only said one, one of them has chosen what is right, what is best at that moment. Martha had good intentions and Mary had good intentions too. Mary was eager to hear from Jesus. She wanted to spend time with him. She wanted to know more about him. Whereas Martha was worried about the cooking. I don't know if you can relate to this story or you found yourself in this scenario before. Jesus is trying to tell us not to be worried about so many things. As believers, as Christians, as non-believers, sometimes we can get easily distracted with so many things that are happening. I gave examples yesterday. It could be loss of a loved one. It could be um, bereavement, depression, anxieties. You're overwhelmed about all these things. And this stops you from focusing on what is important. It's my prayer that God will give you the strength to face each day. God will give you the courage to fight whatever distraction that is stopping you from serving, from praying, from worshipping. That he will give you the wisdom to carry on with each day. It doesn't matter what it is. Come to God in prayers. And he listens. He's always there for you. Even as you go out today, I pray you have a good day. And I pray that you spend moments today and just thank him and ask him to help you. It doesn't matter what you're going through. He is there to listen and he is there to help us. I will recommend a song by Sinaj Waymaker. And I pray that you listen and be blessed. I'll look forward to seeing you join me tomorrow. For now, have a good day and bye for now. Bye.